Hello and welcome to my channel. I am Akram and you are watching Knowledge360. In this video, I will show you how you can restore your database using PG Admin 4 tool and the database will be restored on PostgreSQL 16 server. Okay, that one I am using. So before that, I will let you know from where you can get a sample database to so that you can practice it. This is the website link and when you click on this, you will get the sample database. I have already done it and this is ready with me now let's go here and in the previous video as we have already seen how to create database how to create connections now let's create the database the database name is dvd rental i create create one database with the same name and as we know that other parameters are not mandatory so we can skip them and click on save to create the database okay so the database is created now if i expand it and if i can show you that there will be no view no tables nothing because the database is creating newly okay so now what i'll do i'll load a sample database that will that is i'll restore the database okay so right click on the database name and then go to restore option click here and now we need to select the format there are three ways how to do it uh, to restore your database that is uh, on PostgreSQL server using PG Admin 4 tool. So one is using a .bak file that is backup file. Second is using tab file that is tab archive file that is .tar file. And other option is we can also uh, load the data using uh, the directory okay so first let's uh, using customer tier option then we'll come to directory option as well so after selecting that one okay so here we, we can select the option first we'll do using the tier option so click this and now click on restore process has started and the process is completed now if i refresh it and again if i come and i show so the we have views we have tables and we also have the data okay so now what i'll do i'll delete this i'll delete the database now again i'll create the database in the same way save so the database is blank database is created now i'll restore again using this other option i'll keep it customer tier then click on file all file then i'll use the dvd rental dot backup file that is dot bak file okay click on ok then again restore So the database is restored again if I refresh it and show you the tables. Okay, so again the database is restored. Now again I'll drop it. Database I'll create. Database is created now. This time I'll restore the database using the other option that is using the directory okay i have selected in the format directory and then i'll select that directory so within this folder we have this directory within that we have the data files if i show you so here so all this the data files are in this format so we need to select the directory whatever the directory is available so i am selecting the directory now i'll click on restore so we are expecting that this will restore our database again. So now let's refresh this. So uh, in this video, I have shown you how to restore or load your sample database or any database using three options. We have using PG admin tool in the PostgreSQL 16 server. So one option is to use the tape archive file that is .tar file. Second option is to use backup file that is .bak file and the third option is to use the directory option so all three ways uh, are possible so in the next video i'll again show you how to take the backup okay so in this video we have loaded the sample database but if you have already database with you but you want to take the backup 
of the database in the format of tar in the format of uh, backup or in the format of directory so i'll show you those operations in the next video so let's meet in the next video and if this video was helpful to you please do like and subscribe my channel to get the notifications for upcoming videos so till then take care bye bye